True, true, true. What's going on, y'all? Salute. I want to talk about um, something I've been thinking about and adding up concerning Jay Z, Jay Prince, and in the middle, we have Yo Gotti. And on the way out, we got P. Diddy. Now, if you're looking at this first photo, it'll probably make a little bit of better sense. And this is just a conversational piece. By no means am I saying that any of what I'm we talking about or discussing is 100% facts. And sometimes I have to do it like that. And uh, I think most people that pay attention or tune in the true results know exactly what I mean when I say that. With that being said, if you're looking at this first photo, you see Jay-Z. You see Brother Love, aka P. Diddy, Puffy, all of that. Everything down there, symbol number two. And you see, what I like to say, him lusting after the big head motherfucker. I don't know, guys, I don't rap through, I mean, you know, this I have to say that. Because, what if well, what, what if what if y'all knew for sure and just picked aside that everything and what it appears to be? Now, if you look at this whole, if you look at the whole thing from my perspective, then you see Jay Z has uh, recruited. See, everything is happening. Everything that the big, the big head motherfucker is doing and uh, is under Jay Z's umbrella, umbrella, umbrella. Is under Jay Z, so he has been recruited. Now we already see what's forming. They want Memphis once again to be the new Atlanta. And that's another inter interesting point, Atlanta, because it's something that's about to come to the light. I'm in uh working with one of my brothers behind the scenes. Something that is fit y'all gonna be shown that will make uh Atlanta real important to the conspiracy to take out Young Dog. But we'll get to that at the appropriate time. Now, got it, got everything that he wanted. Since he see he got everything that he wanted. He, he got protection, he got he got his uh big ass in industry deal. You know what I'm saying? He trying to assert himself to be uh the king of Memphis, the liaison, the one that made it possible to get rid of Dolph so that the industry comes can come to Memphis and do what they do in every other state, you know. Bring a whole lot of sick ass uh, ritual, black magic, doing ass, industry ass shit when Memphis has always been an independent town, right? I'm talking about for real, so now they want to change that. That's why they sent Jay-Z to get Dolph. I mean, to get, well, you might well say get Dolph too, to recruit Big Head. Because it was a perfect opportunity for a lot of people to come bring that shit to Memphis. So it's like, we're gonna, um, first we're gonna try to buy, buy the Flipper Man out. Put him under a, a contract deal. We're gonna get him off from 22 million and, you know, then we're gonna then we're gonna make him bow down. <laughs> it's kinda like how Dolph laughed there. What y'all think I should do? Take the 22 million? Or say fuck the 22 million. Fuck the 22 million. And Dolph laughed. And that was that was that was the beginning. That was that was another major milestone and what was about to take place. Then on top of that, the same Jay-Z, Dolph, using his own goddamn money, and then, uh, can I, bro, what's up, Jigga, my nigga? Can I give you $2 million for, well, very huh? <laughs> how something? How you, how your little bitty smile for your ass? I'm on, I'm, you know, over, over, how you, you gonna, how you, where you get $2 million from to offer me $2 million? I ain't never heard nobody offer me, Big Jay Z, two million dollars, and you ain't even in the. I don't never see it, no industry parties or nothing. You ain't at the brunch or nothing. I dare you. All right, it's all with. That's a double. That, okay, you fucked up two times. So let me go over here and align myself with your with, with, with your ops and play both of y'all. That's big here. 
Big Ed wasn't like dog. Big Ed been wanting to play it. Big Ed didn't sign so many goddamn overlapping deals. It's a damn shame Jay got what he wanted. See, fame is different. You know what I'm saying? It will lead you astray. So he had to go ahead and cut his finger and sign, sign the, uh, the, 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 the contract that y'all call blood contract just to get what he wanted. Next thing you know, Dolph out the way. Uh, he don't, even if he know he being used and he, his ass up next, it don't even matter. You know what I'm saying? Some, 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 sometimes people just, just really just want what they want. They don't even care. I'm gonna die one day anyway. Might well get what I, yeah, cut my finger, let me sign. Yeah, y'all gonna get it back in blood anyway. But he got there, he, he on the court, he got a hundred million dollars. He got play money uh, for Dolph. <laughs> Dolph left here, and it's, I find it kind of funny that they got Dolph listed if you Google Dolph Network. Three million dollars, somebody need to stop it. Three million dollars or, or what? A couple of cars? The pinky ring, but anyway, now they got him on the cover. Big head, a hundred million dollars. All this shit happening right after, right? Now, let's go over to um, a significant person that came in, pulled up, hopped out, pulled up, hopped out, uh, gave a little flu gay's ass interview, got stumped on, suppressed, real that shit back in within two days. Brick wolf pack at the ace tag. Now, when I say Jay Prince and the shit. Now, it's a whole lot of mystery and it's a whole lot of conversation that's been had about some kind of typing now. Me, I ain't gonna put emphasis on that. I'm just saying this video is for conversational purposes and also can be served as educational purposes if you look at it. Uh, with that being said, now we already know these two giants, Prince and uh, Jay Z, been that and kind of like playing like chess. They just make one move every four, five years. Slow chess game. They've been playing for years, and now uh, that that Houston, that Texas connect, and being that Beyonce is from Houston. And that pipeline and all the motherfucking shit. Now, this is on the big board, the big chess board, not the little bit of chess board. That only giants can play on because they see shit yeah, that we can't see, you know, checkerboard shit. But what I'm saying is, what if the whole play has been a battle of Jay Prince and Jay Z and Big Head just like a, like, like a, a, a strategic move? For the for the for the for what we can't see, and his big head ass has been. That's what I'm showing y'all this picture. Like, it's how coincidental incidental is it that P Diddy over there with his arm wrapped around you lusting, and Jay Z and brought you around this motherfucker, brother love, and and brother love over there like salivating, and and, and, and next thing you know, brother love on his way out, right? What if it's the, it's, what if, what if, what if Prince and, what if the whole thing is a big ass, but well, we already know it's a big ass play. And that's why what we see in court with, with uh, that's who back in, that's who was back in uh, Cobain and might well say the whole goddamn shit. Straight drive too. That, and the, and, the, and the powers that be the judicial system. That would make more sense, being that it's all an investment in Memphis. Don't forget about this $10 million facility that they built to state of the art car studio for their plan. It's already under works. And everybody is in place from the new mayor all to the goddamn, what I showed y'all uh, in a few videos back, the Chamber of Commerce, they got a big plan and it's all hip hop related. And that means billions of uh, dollars in investment. And one man with the land and one man with the plan such as Doe was in the way of all of this shit. And uh, y'all can elaborate and feel free to uh, start the conversation and get it popping in the conversation, in the uh, comment section. But this is just me talking to y'all. You know what I'm saying? Pay attention and wake up. Because as y'all can see, they folks ain't playing no game. 
or you keep going up and you keep pressing them goddamn pressure points and buttons such as what we doing over here oh uh, it gets it gets dirty it gets it, yeah i mean who am i Shit, i'm just a, i'm a king just like my brother dog with or without money once you once you once you jeopardizing and threatening they uh or threaten to expose them and do all this. You gotta, you gotta be about it. Or uh, play, uh, play with it. We ain't playing. So I appreciate y'all tuning in. Like, share, subscribe. Always support. I'm saying one more time. Like, share, subscribe. Always support. Cash out, die sign. True results number two. Look for the red hat. And uh, let me say, let me, let me say. I do that on another video. I'm just finna shout out a few people who deserve to be shouted out and uh, donated, and I'm gonna try to do it more. But I gotta switch over and do a lot of stuff to do in this video. But before I go, just to let y'all know, y'all know who you are, um, and I'll be shouting y'all out in the very next video. Until then, I love y'all, and y'all stay safe, and y'all keep a prayer up and a candle burning for all the truth, cause it's crunch time. True, I love.